Well, when you spend that many years, and that many hours in a facility, that means more than just football. It can't help almost have an influence on your life. It's a staple of our community. It's a place where people gather. It's a place where families make memories. People will remember for the rest of their lives. And it just happens to be a place where we play football. There's so many good memories in here. In the 50s, there were some incredible championships won in here. And then, of course, the 66 game with Notre Dame. I don't think there's ever been more electricity in the air for an atmosphere for a football game, at least at Spartan Stadium. There he goes, and they go ahead. The Ohio State game in the 70s. Ohio State is trailing. There were so many games that I watched on TV, but I've seen all but four in the last 40 years. This is Lorenzo White. He's got an opening 30, 25, 20, right down the sideline, and he stretches into the end zone. Here come the students. I have never heard of a coach going into the visiting locker room after the game to congratulate the team. Bill Mallory of Indiana came into the Michigan State locker room after he just got beat in a big night game. I'm just going to say this. By God, go out to the coast and kick their ass because we're all damn tired. Yeah. Harry Truman spoke at my college graduation in this stadium, introduced by Dr. John Hanna. And then years later, Bill Clinton spoke at a graduation here. It's a game night at Spartan Stadium. We'll play hockey on a football field. How can you forget the Cold War? 70,000 plus at a hockey game in Spartan Stadium. How often is that gonna happen? When you're playing hockey in the state of Michigan and Gordy Howe shows up, and, and a youper like Tom Izzo, those guys made it special. He had it on his stick for a moment, comes to the side, it's a goal for Michigan State! The Spartans have tied it up with 47 seconds! Rushed out of the pocket, on the run. It's a touchdown, Michigan State! Rodgers over the middle, incomplete! And Nick can finally breathe for the first time today. Rolls to his right. Wants to throw back left and does. It's up for grabs in the end zone. It is caught. It's caught by TJ. Touchdown, MSU. The Spartans win. The Spartans win. I don't like it. I don't love it. I live it, as they say, and uh, I really do. And I love the enthusiasm. I love come bringing recruits down here on the field. Uh, Mel's so great. But this goes back to, you know, the George Perlis days when I first got here. And, and all the coaches in between have uh, embraced and welcomed me. Inside the 20. He's inside the 10. He's into the end zone. Here's the snap and the put down. The kick is up. The kick wow. is good. It's good! The Spartans will win this thing! And then the fans, you know, I mean, there's nothing like uh, the different things I've seen go on here, the transformation of the place. It, it's really gone a long ways from when I started here. Spartans win in overtime! East Lansing is a, a big football town. Spartan Stadium is where people want to be in the fall. It's woven into the fabric of this community. Oh, they'll fake it. Bates. Throws it. He's got him. Yeah, wide open. <laughs> He's got Charlie Gant inside the 10. He can walk in. Spartans win. There was a time when I had a Piston game in Florida the night before the Michigan-Michigan State game here, and they arranged for a chopper to pick me up at Metro Airport. And looking down from the chopper and seeing stadium full, and yet all these people Thousands of people were outside the stadium. Let me know how much football and great rivalry games mean to all the fans. Kirk rolls to his right. Finally sends a long spiral to the end zone. Tapped he got right it! And caught at the goal line. Caught at the goal line. He got over, George. There was a silence for like five minutes. The runner did cross the goal line. There it is! I heard Spartans win! Unbelievable! Touchdown! Touchdown! MSU! What that marks for me is the joy that people get out of Spartan Stadium. Let's go! Michigan State wouldn't be the Michigan State it is right now if it weren't for Spartan Stadium. It just adds to the character of the school. It's a source of pride in our community, I believe. 15, 
He's inside the 10, inside the five, into the end zone. I think we got a heck of a student section over there now of 14, 15,000. We've got some diehards that have been here forever. It's up, it's long It's gone! And it's, it's gone! gone! Matt Coughlin, the hero. They've got to get it to Kenneth Walker. Here's the give. Walker! Kenneth Walker! Touchdown! Smart! This 15th thing of the ball game. The joint is rocking, thanks to Kenneth Walker. And there is still nothing better of when it's snowing and big flakes, Spartans are winning, and I get to just enjoy the whole thing. College football is here to stay. There's so much emotion tied up in college football that I think Spartan Stadium is going to be an, an awesome place for Michigan State fans and football fans in general, hopefully for another 100 years. It's more than just football. It's being a Spartan, it's being an alum or student and feeling good about it.